What were some of your highlights of the year? Well, Michael, uh, Patrick Hutchings, by the way, was actually professionally a philosophy lecturer, which is one of the reasons why he was rather hard to understand as an art critic. <laughs> his, his middle name was Aeneas, which was totally splendid and uh, terrific if you'd ever studied ancient history. He was Patrick Aeneas Hutchings, and Billy used to call him Patrick Aesthetic Hutchings because he, uh, because he thought he did, uh, didn't uh, speak the language as Ben Johnson said, such as men do use. He used another kind of language that nobody understood. Um, but uh, what I remember most about this show, apart from the fact that we did it live and we weren't paid, was the fact that um, I actually, I mean, this is nobody under the age of uh, 50 would understand this, but uh, I, I was moonlighting at the ABC at that stage. I actually worked for the West Australian. And uh, the idea that you can moonlight full on on television is such an absurd idea that even I find it. <laughs> However, moonlighting I was, and I, I, it was my assumption that nobody except Bill, my parents, and everybody else's parents and children who were forced to watch it were actually watching. <laughs> and um, I arrived at work on one Wednesday and uh, after the show, and uh, you know, settled down at my uh, at my desk uh, in the middle of I was in the middle of the the newsroom, the huge old newsroom of the West Australian, surrounded by the sporting desk, which was always rather fun because the language was even racier from the sporting desk. And uh, the wonderful, late lamented Jeff Christian came in, the great sort of shambling Jeff, who at that stage of the game was a, an extremely heavy drinker and a very lively fellow, generally speaking. He always had a fag hanging out of the corner of his mouth. And he lolloped into the room and crashed around and made a huge noise as he entered. And he yelled out at the top of his voice, Die, he said, God, heard you talking about art last night. And I said, uh, Yes, said Jeff, you know, hoping that he'd sort of keep it down because thinking I didn't want the boss to know about it. And I said, Jeff, I, I didn't know you were interested in culture. And he said, I'm not, mate, for God's sake, it comes just before the soccer from England. <laughs> <laughs> and, and he was the only person that I ever met, apart from my own blood family, who I ever knew that admitted watching a review. <laughs>